In November of 2000, the National Zoo got two pandas, Meishan and Tin Tin. In April of 2003, the pandas were old enough to mate. Unbelievably, a female panda can only get pregnant for two days per year. This makes no sense. Humans can get pregnant any day of the year. Since pandas are at the top of their food chain, we don't want tons of them competing with each other. So that's why it's so hard for them to get pregnant. For two years, the pandas mated, but Mei Song did not get pregnant. In the spring of 2005, the zoo tried to get them pregnant through artificial insemination. That's when they tried to get pregnant in a laboratory instead of at the zoo. It worked. Meishan got pregnant. It's awesome when a panda has a baby, don't you think? It's like a little stick of butter shooting out of the mommy. Zookeepers were worried at first because the old pandas at the zoo on five different occasions had Babies that died within days of being born. Luckily, the cub survived, and tradition says to name the panda on his 100th day of life. There was a vote on the internet to pick a name. The winning name is Tai Shan, which means peaceful mountain. As part of an agreement between the U.S. and China, Tai Shan was moved to China when he was four and a half years old.